One of the oldest models in Volkswagen's lineup, the Amarok has been around since 2010 and won't transition to the next generation until sometime next year. Meanwhile, the company's Australian division has teamed up yet again with local engineering firm Walkinshaw to follow up on last year's beefy Ute Special Edition. The new W580X picks up where the more on-road focused W580s left off, adding a suspension lift kit for improved ground clearance. There's even an optional snorkel available, along with upgraded twin tube dampers and 18-inch forged wheels wrapped in all-terrain tires housed within enlarged wheel arches. Volkswagen and Walkinshaw have also added extra underbody protection and an LED light bar. At the heart of the new Amarok W580X is a twin turbo diesel 3.0 liter V6 engine pumping out 255 horsepower and 580 newton meters of torque. The TDI punch is delivered to both axles courtesy of a full time four wheel drive system via an eight speed automatic transmission. As you would expect from a high end special edition, the truck is loaded with equipment. From bi xenon headlights with LED daytime running lights to dual zone automatic climate control, the Amarok W580X has all the essential kit. Heated front seats are also on the agenda, as are rubber floor mats and a tire pressure monitoring system. To sweeten the deal, Volkswagen and Walkinshaw are adding velar upholstery, while tweaking the exterior with black mirrors and rear bumper as well as a redesigned front grille. It could very well be the last hurrah for the first-gen Amarok as the all-new, Ford Ranger-based pickup truck has already been officially confirmed to debut next year. The Blue Oval will assemble the vehicle in South Africa, and the rumor mill suggests a performance-oriented version could serve as Volkswagen's equivalent of the Ranger Raptor.